Well, hello and welcome back to my wine tasting series that I started here. Um, like I said last time in my other video, we are doing Camelot Mead from Oliver as well. Um, they are located down in Bloomington, Indiana, for anybody that knows who that, where that is. Um, all right, let's get into it. Um, first thoughts, the label is beautiful. I love this. I really didn't look at it when I first got it, but sitting here getting ready to record this, I was like, wow. Um, so Camelot Mead, it's a honey wine, um, so it's going to be a little bit different. Um, let's see. It smells very sweet. Pretty sure it's a sweet line wine, if I remember correctly. Um, I don't have it pulled up right now, and I can't remember when I asked for it. Um, this one does have 10% alcohol, though. Most wines are kind of in that range, um, I believe. All right, honey wine. Hmm. I'm not a very big beer person. I know mead is more along the lines of like the beer, more fermented kind of thing. Um, definitely getting like a beer aftertaste. Um, what is it in my mouth? Pretty good. Do you like the honey? Um, do you really get that through? But the aftertaste for me, not my favorite. Um, I'd probably prefer the cherry moscato after flavor, so that bubbly, sultry thing over um, a beer. That's just my personal preference though. Um, more if you do like beer, um, you do like more mild tones. This honestly wasn't very sweet as I thought it was by the smell. Um, so it's kind of mild. Um, got that meaty, as in beer aftertaste, not like ribeye or something, you know. Um, but this would probably be good with like some red meat, not gonna lie. Or like some spaghetti. That's one of them for dinner tonight, actually. Spaghetti with some meat. Mm, delicious. Um, but overall, it's not bad. The aftertaste, like I said, is a little weird. But overall, I would uh, definitely recommend it uh, if you're looking for something, like I said, a little bit more mild. Um, and just buy it for this label, honestly. Like, look at that. The detail. Yes. Incredible. Um, next time, my next video, I have another one. Um, I don't believe it's a wine. It's more of like a spritzer, seltzer, I believe, from Oliver. It's one of those ones that they were trying out, um, one of their experimental things, I think. Um, I didn't actually go. Like I said, I got these from my mom. Um, and I'm just doing what she said they were, I guess. It just sounded good. I think it's like a lavender or something. Super excited about that. Um, but yeah, I will see you next time. Thank you.